Hi. This presentation will show you how easy it is to bring data into the RSS Bus SharePoint web part and format it with the rich text editor. Let's give it a try. Here's a web part page. We'll just get an instance of the RSS Bus SharePoint web part. We'll configure the web part. And you can see this web part configuration panel on the right. I'll type the URL to the Yahoo News feed into this box. And now we'll open the Rich Text Editor to format the output. I happen to know that all RSS feeds return a data item called RSS Title, so we'll put that here. And they return an RSS description, which we'll put here. We use these double square brackets to get the web part to evaluate these data names. OK, we'll save, and there's the Yahoo News right on our web part page. Well, the title is kind of small. Let's work on it. I'll go back to the editor and make the title bold and a little bigger. And while we're at it, Let's link it to the actual news story on Yahoo. News feeds have a field called RSS link, so that's what we'll use. OK, there. That's better. Let's try the link. And there's the news. I hope you'll visit the RSS Bus website and learn more about the RSS Bus SharePoint web part and the rest of the RSS Bus family of products. Thanks for watching.